Hey, what's up everyone? It's Dolbeck. Today, for a new world video, uh, I got something kind of insane. The eel died, there was no eel, and you know, I'm a good tank, so I don't need heal. I can beat Gorgon, first boss of the red, without healing. And if you don't, if you want to know how, you're gonna have to watch the gameplay. Nah, I'm just kidding. You're gonna see there is uh, a way if you hit the back leg of the bus. You, you need to make sure right now if you have some mini DPS, do not do that because you're gonna kill. <laughs> <laughs> all your mini DPS, these strats only work when all your DPS is ranged or your mini DPS are dead, alright? So if you hit the side of the bus into the back leg, mostly with the hatchet, it worked with the sword and shield too, but with the hatchet, there's just more haste and tracking into it. So you're just gonna hit the back leg by the side of the bus and the bus gonna turn slowly by trying to hit you and there's a way to be constantly there hitting the bus while it's spinning and you are spinning around it and the only thing that is there killing me at the end I could be soloing this bus by myself almost but the only thing that killed me is the crystal so I guess I can almost solo this bus if I'm if I manage to go like I don't know very low con and, and take no damage and destroy destroy the crystal by myself, it's almost it's maybe possible. So you say, I start to think it's possible, but you know, not gonna join a red by yourself and try that. But yeah, gotta try that one day. So I let you guys watch the gameplay. You're gonna see my thinking gameplay is kind of insane. I've been thinking since the start of this game, and if you wonder what this is. It's uh, my 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 father have a no a African lady and she given me that so it's African outfit, bro. Yeah, and look, I I even got some pocket in there, man. Yeah, I'm vibing right now. Look at this. Yeah. You can start by pulling by the right. Do just one shot to the. Okay, someone pulled the spider, so we're gonna do spider first. Just right. long to do spider one for one. I don't want to use my tank on that. Okay. Nice. You're gonna pass beside me and then they're gonna come back. They are supposed to pass like beside me because the dude is supposed to line of sight really far behind but since he's too close the bird are like staying over there and i just the the calamity thing is not putting everything like if the dude was running really far away the calamity counter would put everything that passed on my side and then it would like go somewhere hit and then come back to me Wait before I'm done I'm done pulling before shooting the rest. I'm just gonna go into the corner over there so it's all gonna stack on me. And you can put a secret when I'm gonna be into the corner. Right there. You see I'm into the corner over there? Yeah. You can DPS the thing that are on me. The the uh, the Corvid is supposed to come if the DPS are think the good thing right now. And the Corvid. I guess it looked like the aggro instead of Yeah, yeah it did. Yeah, no, it did. Bring him back in the corner. Yep. There is a second phase of ads in this room, so instead of just keeping the PSing the mini boss. I'm going in the center trying to be at the best place 
where I can taunt the, uh, as much of them as I can and instead of running around with the mobs and killing all my DPS trying to get the aggro of one and the other I'm, you're gonna see I'm gonna call in the mic if you have the aggro pull them on me and then I'm gonna use my taunt and my rotation by keeping always one on so if there's a DPS that listen to me and bring a mob to me, then I'm gonna take the aggro. But at this moment, if I have the aggro of almost everything and there's only one mob running away because there's a DPS probably not hitting the same ads as me. Because if I'm there hitting a mob and the DPS is hitting a mob, he's not supposed to, to get the aggro of something else, you see? So... Most of the time they are not hitting the exact same as the tank. This is the reason why they're going to get the aggro at this moment. Because the one that's going to get the aggro is the healer. If the tank is not getting the aggro of the adds, the adds going to go to the healer because he's getting aggro by healing. And the healer can direct the aggro. He's going to come into the sacred ground with you. He's going to use his fortify. Like there's some fortify on the void blade. On the scream. There's a couple of ways to survive as a healer. When you go into a sacred on the side of the tank. It feel kind of safe. So you see I'm a, I'm a healer. So I know. And yeah this is what you want to aim for. So make sure to have no DPS killing spider right now. Just do the puzzle after that. There's gonna be another phase before that. I'll spawn okay. now. If you have that like, hope, just put it into the center of the room and I'm putting it down. Like soon as soon as you pull something on me. Okay. There you go. better at healing bro I feel a difference since the last time I don't think he can hear you oh, it's so the DPS are not supposed to hit the ads yeah they're supposed to be on the right I'll go for the right what happened there's not people. You need melees to stand on the pillar or on the platforms. Melee. All right. Yeah. Here we go. I'm on the other platform. Start getting spider down. That's shooting the thing. Don't kill the spider. Yeah, nobody's on this platform. Stand on the platform. Do the, the puzzle, guys. Got the first one on the right. Second one. Just heal that tank, don't heal the DPS that, that are um, not doing the right thing. If they are doing the wrong thing, it's okay, I guess. Alright, one more on the left. Yeah, good. Just swap to rip your second. Hold on, let me. uh. Let me uh potion up real quick. I changed up my hammer and my great sword so my stats was not perfect. I really like to go reach that 33% uh, stamina region rate, but I was not like, oh, I'm gonna, I'm, I was not willing to spend money on that. It was not really worth it. It was not if it was speed run or anything. So I just decided to try it like that.
guys said because he has taunt too. It's a bug. Yeah, I have taunt. That there's taunt on my weapon. Like you can read the description. Now I have the carnity and just this game is weird. There you go. I'm gonna put. Take it off and put it back on. The aggro always been a problem in your world, but at this point, when you have a hammer that doesn't taunt like one third of the time, and when you have a rapier that the sometimes the ripples work all the time, and sometimes the ripples just don't even work. Like it, the repost is a taunt. You can go read the description with the rapier. You can taunt, and you can see me into other video. I use a rapier with a carnelian and a hatchet with no carnelian into it, and I, I'm just face tanking this boss like that usually, and I have, and yeah, you know, and then I put the carnelian in my hatchet, and it, now everything is fine. <laughs> Crystal later, I guess. Heavy attacks, guys. Right there, you're gonna see I realize that I have no melee in my group. I took the time to analyze the gameplay and I've seen like the pillar health go low and 
that no no melee around and, and i was like okay so the range gps is fine and there's no melee i'm gonna try the strats the it's the back leg and this is when i start doing it and you see for the the, the bus it's harder at the end and when there's some crystal around at the start i yeah i just wanted to give a chance to the melee in the group if they was there to come and hit it and they did not do it so it's why i started to make this bus spin a bit About to break his stamina, attack his back where the spikes come out. Right here, where the ring is. Big suit, big city, make sure you're attacking his back, not his tail. Gotcha. I'm gonna turn the bus again. Put him into a better direction. There we go. Focus crystals. During the crystal phase, sometimes there's some DPS that like tunnel vision on the bus and don't see what happens. So if you start to run around with the bus, it's gonna like signal to them that there's something that is happening. And you can take care for sure to not kill people, it's just to move the bus away and uh, the crystal put some rents, so it's better if you don't take too much it. And the main reason why I move around, it's not even for that. If my healer don't have to heal me, he's gonna be able to uh, destroy the crystal with the DPS with his void gauntlet or life staff or whatever he have. Half a bar, and we're gonna go up and attack his legs when he's screaming. Ten percent more on this bar. All right, start moving towards him. I'm gonna move him into the middle, straight up. All right, get ready to attack his slugs right here. Free DPS, free DPS. All right, he's gonna shoot out spikes and then he's gonna jump. When he jumps, you have to dodge when he lands or it will down you. Get ready, dodge. Get ready, dodge. Get ready. Dodge. Get ready. Dodge. We're coming in the middle to break the stamp. This right there is one of the main reason why movement build are amazing in this bus fight if you can bring the bus in the middle just before you break the stamina the dps are really gonna be surrounded 
All right, yep, get ready. Everybody move towards his back, attack where the spikes come out. Move in, move in. On his back, on his back. Good job, guys. That was good damage. Uh, ha, 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 ha. What happened? Oh, so we had crystal. We had a crystal. Uh, yes, I was trying to kill. Oh. Kill me, damn it! You got to call out that crystal, dude. I didn't see it behind the blocks. Focus crystals. Yeah, I'm down. <clears throat> Fine, son, I don't need you. Jump. The rest is just a intense Dolbeck entertainment gameplay like usual, so I'm just gonna put some music on and I wish everyone a good day, tell someone you love them, peace out. Keep heavy attacking. Get off pillars. Focus crystals. Drawing free DPS. Crystals. You got crystals right here. Keep focusing crystals, guys. Heavy attacks. We can break a stamina bar and get him pretty low. Fail. Warlock stand inside of the purple ring when I put it down. Gives you 15 percent more damage. Focus crystals. Everybody on crystal.
All right, heavy attacks. Let's break a stamina here. Jump. Jump. Yeah. Heavy attacks. Heavy attacks. Crystals. It's gonna be close, we're losing all of our damage. Jumping, one more jump. Dodge. Break his stamina here. Heavy attacks, heavy attacks. Yeah. Everybody get ready to attack his back. Alright, start moving in. He's gonna go down. Everybody on his back stand inside the purple rings. Oh, come on, really? Yeah, just after that. Oh. He is one hit away. Heavy attacks. Dark Heavy attacks. Dogs, uh, uh, Crystal. Oh. No, Crystal. Crystal. Yeah, just focus him. Focus, monster. Everyone attack his back. Crystals, crystals. Alright, crystals. I'm gonna do enough damage. Focus crystals, sticks right behind you. Focus this crystal sticks. Alright, crystals are down. Just light attacks, we're not gonna break a stamina again. Just stay on boss. Stay on boss. Guys, focus boss. We can just have to go. Here we got two DPS that aren't staying on boss. Crystals that aren't destroyed, so we need to either kill them or kill those crystals. Make up our minds. Uh, damn. Why were those two DPSs? If they stayed on boss, we would have won it. But they attacked some of the crystals, but then left some. It was very confusing. It's literally like one more to it. Oh, you're the only one. Attack him. Oh! Wow. I'm the only one for real now. <laughs> what does it do? I can res maybe. 
the thing I don't do enough DPS. You, you attack, you attack. I'm gonna keep the aggro. It's my job. Nice. Jeez. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> wow. wow. You, you. That was so close. That was yeah. ridiculous. <laughs>